All right, so I'm back over here at this lake and uh, I see a bass right behind this uh, rock here. We're gonna try and get him with that worm on the jig head. So let's go, we're on four pound test. Let's make it happen. Bucket mouth. Holy heck. Look at that one, guys. That worm on that jig hit. Ugh. Let's get up here. Well, guys, there's that one. That's a freaking good one. Bucket mouth for sure. Off of that worm on that jig head. And uh, man, this guy's fat. Let's go ahead and weigh this guy. So this guy is three pounds. Hold on, let me get my camera so I can show you guys. He's three pounds, eight ounces. Not too bad, that's a nice fish. That's a really nice fish, guys. All right, so I'm gonna take pictures with this guy and I'm gonna get him back in the water, but that's a nice fish. All right, so there's that bass. Man, that's a nice one. Bucket mouth for sure. And uh, as you can see, this guy, he's blind in one eye. It's crazy. Hit the worm on the GK, baby. Let's get back in the water. And there she goes, she's out. Let's uh, get that one here. But, Came in at three pounds, eight ounces. Let's freaking go. Got him, guys. That's freaking crazy. All right, man. He's a short little fat one there, but again, he's thick. Damn, look at that. He's thick, guys. Let's take a better look at this guy and uh, weigh him in. Man. Let's see what he weighs. But worm on the jig head. Let's freaking go. All right, so second one of the morning, and uh, this guy's a short little fat one for real. Look at that belly, that's crazy. Off of the worm on the jig head. We're gonna weigh him in here. See what this one comes up as, huh? I'm just curious. 
I mean, I'm thinking he's like two, two and a half pounds. Wow, that was a good guess. All right, let's see here so you guys can see. All right. So, two pounds, eight ounces. Let's freaking go, guys. That's a good fish off of the worm on the jig head. Okay, so this is a 14 inch fish, guys. 14 freaking inches, and uh, he's two pounds, eight ounces. Let's put him back in the water. All right, putting that two pound, eight ounce bass back. All right, let's try and get into another one here. our way down here and grab this fish. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, big guy. Hold on. Hold on. You're not making things any easier. Ooh, all right, so got that one right there. Let's uh, take a better look at her here. That worm on the jig head right there at the top of her mouth. Let's freaking go. Well, there's that one. That worm on that jig head and the third fish we hooked into. And uh, we're about to weigh this baby right now. And uh, she was just stuck again on a bed. And uh, she was getting mad. She didn't like this thing and she just sucked it right up. All right, here we go. On this one, look at this, guys. Here we go. So, two pounds, 14 ounces. Almost a three pound fish, guys. Not too bad, let's freaking go. Tip the tail to that. That's an 18 inch fish, guys. Not too freaking bad. 18 inch fish weighing in at two pounds 14 ounces let's freaking go all right putting that bass back it's a nice one guys that's a freaking nice one All right. 
Ooh, we, we got her. And that was not an easy task, guys. I'll tell you. I am like falling in to this damn spot. But we got the bass. Oh my God. Ooh. Ooh, we. All right. Uh. Oh boy, that was not easy, guys. Oh, but we freaking did it, and it's a tank. Let's uh, take a better look at this one, huh? Well, there's that one off of the worm on that jig head, and uh, this is a good one, guys. We're gonna go ahead and weigh her. All right, here we go. Yeah, 311 again. Sorry, I just had to, I had to recheck it. Man, that's a nice fish. 311, guys. All right, let's put her down. Get the tape measure out. They'll work with us today. So, a 18 inch uh, bass. That's not bad. 18 inches, guys. Whew. Thing's a freaking beast. Let's put him back in the water. All right. Ooh. Oh, my ass. Ooh, shit. All right. All right, guys. Releasing that bass. Whew. That's a nice one. And she's off. All right, I'm gonna get back up here before I fall in. Well, that's gonna wrap this one up on the Big Bass Fight Challenge. And we definitely were getting into them on day one and day two, guys. And we used a variety of different baits, but the majority of the bass came off of that worm on the jig head. And I mean, that thing is super deadly, guys. That's why I like using those cream trout worms. It definitely catches you fish and some nice ones so if you guys like this stuff and you're learning something smash that like button subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i'll catch you guys on the next one